several residents in Chesterfield were in for quite the surprise this morning when they woke up to no water. The worst morning for this mm. Chesterfield police confirmed that several calls came in from residents experiencing no water or low water pressure in the area around Iron Gate Drive. Eight News reporter Cheyenne Pagan spoke with a resident who was impacted. She's now joining us live in that area and Cheyenne, what did they all have to say? Heather, Deanna, as many woke up this morning ready to make their Thanksgiving meals they encountered a little bit of an obstacle before they could even start. Back up already. When John Zuber went to make a cup of tea this morning, he was a little confused to see he had no water pressure. I don't know how long it's going to be. It's kind of a bad thing on a holiday to have no water to work with because everybody's going to be in the kitchen. And when the pressure started to come back, Zuber says the water had a yellow tint to it. It just was out of uh, real, 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 real deep yellow, and I didn't know how long it would be before you get the color of finished running it. Thankfully, his son was able to bring over several gallons of water for them to use when they cook. You can't help it. No matter what you're doing, you got to wash your pans or put them in a the dishwasher, whatever. So that's why I had him bring uh, 14 gallons of uh, water from his house. He has the uh, those big water things and. It works. I just he brought them over, sent them in the door here in case you need them. Chesterfield police say they got several calls from residents experiencing no water or low water pressure in the area around Iron Gate Drive. The county's Department of Utilities said repair crews were dispatched to the area around 530 this morning to begin fixing a water main break. Throughout the morning, Zuber said he was starting to see improvements, but still figured it was better to be safe than sorry. You can't help it. No matter what you're doing, you got to wash your pans or put them in a the dishwasher, whatever. So that's why I had him bring uh, 14 gallons of uh, water from his house. He has the uh, those big water things, and it works. I just he brought him over, sent him in the door here in case you need them. As of 9:30 a.m. this morning, 11 customers were still without water. We'll continue to follow this story and bring you the latest updates on air and online as we get them. Reporting live in Chesterfield County, Cheyenne Pagan, 8 News.